Hello, this is Cat Touch, and I just want to talk about the latest version of firmware and how it improves the SWR testing. If we go into the S if if we have an SD card inserted into Cat Touch, when we do a SWR test, it will now save the test results to the card, and it will save multiple test results until you delete uh, the SWR file off the card. So we'll just keep on adding to it for each band. Now we'll go and have a look at a test. When we go into the SWR screen, it asks us it asks us if the antenna is connected, antenna or load, we say yes. It then asks us if the amplifier is in bypass mode. Again, we will say yes, we hit in bypass mode. And at this point, it now asks us if we want to test the SWR now. If we test the SWR now, it will actually run through and turn the transceiver off and on, testing at different frequencies and plotting the SW results on a chart. If we say no to this, it will go through and check the card that's inserted for any history plots. And as we can see now, it has just done exactly that. And it's drawn the plots in different colours and given us a date and time for each plot on the side here. So we'll go back and we'll actually show you how we have improved the uh, speed of the SWR testing on transceivers such as uh, the very popular Yaesu FT101D. So we will test the SWR now and we can see the first thing it does is show us our history plots and then it is going to run through now um, plotting, measuring and plotting. That, once it completes that, that will be of course stored to the SD card. We can have, and then this list will just keep on going until it runs out of screen space, um, at which case you really should delete the uh, the file or copy it to your computer uh, to use it as a backup because you can import this, this prior SWR history into things like an Excel spreadsheet and chart it with Excel for a better looking chart. There is 40 points that are plotted so it does uh, for your for each band and uh, the uh, Cat Touch does have band information in it for all the uh, current amateur radio bands and of course the CB band. So it is a great little tool for testing your antenna SWR. All right, I just want to say um, thank you for those who are supporting Cat Touch and for uh, letting me know about any bugs and things like that, which hopefully are all now ironed out. We're pretty much near finalised. Okay, thank you. Bye bye.